for the longest time I've always heard people say to me ah oh, you you sound different ah oh, how do you speak that's how I speak that's who I am it's got, it's got hey guys it's welcome back to my channel I'm so excited actually to be doing this video because it's something that's a bit different I decided I was not going to do a makeup tutorial again because uh, that is kind of becoming it's kind of becoming like a, a routine and it's boring you know I decided let me do something different so that you guys can get to know me a few months ago I asked you on my Facebook what would you like to know about me like a get to know me tag and you guys bombarded me with questions and who I just want to say that some of those questions were pretty much irrelevant so I tried to dig into the ones that were very relevant and that will help you guys know the kind of person that I am you know so yes uh, let's just dive right into it Lisa D asked me on Facebook what do you enjoy doing in your spare time in my spare time I like to if I have spare time I like to to do makeup looks on myself I really like use Pinterest a lot and I go through Pinterest and I try to recreate looks from proper makeup gurus sometimes they work out sometimes they don't but I like to do that during my spare time and I also like to read a lot I read uh, a lot of novels I like to read autobiographies and uh, inspirational inspirational books I don't really like fiction like I just don't see how it benefits anybody so yeah I like to read read and uh, create uh, makeup looks. Ashley Tatenda Chaparaza asked me, why haven't you responded to my messages? Sweetheart, I remember you very well. I did respond to you. I was talking to you and then I, the last message that I sent to you, you didn't reply to me for almost like a month and when you texted me next, I just thought, <laughs> okay, you know, I, I will take time to reply you, but I didn't because I also get a lot of messages from other people So I reply to those people. I will reply to you though. It's nothing personal No zippo asked me what's playing in your ear. What was the last meal you cooked? Who are your favorite youtubers top three? Okay, that's a lot of questions, but I'll just quickly get into it What's playing in my ear right now is Nigerian music. I love Nigerian music. Why am I shouting? Okay, I love Nigerian music. I don't know. It just makes me feel good. And what's playing right now in my ear is Davida for money for the year. Uh, 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 uh. I can't sing, but yeah, I love that song. Um, what's the last meal you cooked? I don't cook. That's a thing. I can't even remember what I last cooked. I hate cooking. I'm not a bad cook, but <laughs> cooking is not my thing, you guys. <laughs> I'm so clumsy in the kitchen. I wish I could cook. I wish I could be interested in cooking, but and the last thing that I did was this morning I boiled some eggs and I put them in mayonnaise. That's what I cook now. Who are your favorite top three YouTubers? Patricia Bright! I love her. She inspires me and um Makeup and Shayla, Makeup Shayla, I love that. I love it. Jamie and Nikki, those are my top three favorite YouTubers. I watch them all the time. Sometimes I even forget to upload my own videos watching those guys. Yeah. How do you balance your life? Kuzimati Party asked. How do I balance my life? As in, I don't have a formula. I don't have a formula. I just take everything as it comes. That's it. So I don't want to say I have a formula. I don't want to say this is how I like to do my things. I like to wake up early. I like to go for a jog. I don't do that. I just take it up as it comes. If I have something that I need to do today, I'll just do it. I don't know what you mean. I don't have a formula for these things. Do you currently have a boyfriend? How many languages do you speak? Yes, I do have an amazing. I do have an amazing boyfriend. Yes, he's there. Just so you know, I'm not single. Uh, how many languages do you speak? I speak Shona, I speak English, I speak Zulu. Those are the three main languages that I speak. But when it comes to understanding other languages, I do understand a lot of languages. I understand so, so to. I understand, um, I understand, uh, Pedi. I can hear what she's saying, so don't you be trying to gossip about me because I will hear you. I understand, but I can't speak back. 
I understand Xhosa. Like I really love that language, but I can't speak it. If I had a chance to speak and learn, I would do that. So I speak Shona English, or I do speak Debele as well because I'm from Zim. I understand. I speak. I speak Debele. I speak Shona. I speak Zulu and I speak English. Four languages. What's your current favorite makeup product? Is this lipstick that I'm wearing right now? I love it. I don't know what it does to me, but it just makes everything It can make you believe I love this lipstick. How old are you? I am 25. I just turned 25 in February What do you regret the most? I don't regret anything actually Whatever choices that I've had to make in life. I've had to make them because I needed to make them so Whether they were bad whether they were good it's choices that I've had to make so I don't think I regret anything at all I wish I did no why would I wish to regret something I don't regret anything in my life where did you start makeup I didn't study makeup I am a self-taught uh, uh, aspiring makeup artist um, I know how to beat face I know but I didn't go to school for it I do want to go I do want to go to school for it because I just want to certify myself um, but I don't want to go to uh, like a beauty school where I learn how to apply makeup like the way I did I want to go to a special effects school where I learn you know like <laughs> like what can I say special effects where I, I, I learn special effects that's where I would like to go to and uh, I'll just certify myself yeah. Just to make everything authentic. What career path are you taking? Nursing. That's the career path that I'm taking. Apart from beating face. Apart from from YouTube videos. Yeah, that's the career path that I'm taking. Are you married? No, I'm not married. Who is your makeup inspiration? Makeup Shayla, she is amazing. I love her. Like I, I don't know, man. She does the things that need to be done. If if I get to that point, if I get to that level, don't greet me, y'all, because <laughs> I'll start speaking English. That girl knows what she's doing. I love her. She is my makeup inspiration. You can say whatever, but I love, I love that girl. I love her so much. So. What is your weakness? Hmm. What is my <laughs> I'm ashamed to say this. What is my weakness? Money. <clears throat> yeah, there I said it. Money. I love money. You know when I don't have money, it makes me really sad. It can change my mood. So yeah, money is my weakness. It's not okay, I can control it though. Like it's not it's not going to, to change my my ethics or anything but really having my own money not having it it really affects me I love money oh, I do that's my weakness besides wine what else do you drink I drink gin and tonic that alcohol that liquor can go down you <laughs> how I miss summer I really miss gin and tonic I can't really drink it now because it's cold I have to stick to the red wine but yeah I can drink gin and tonic. I can, I can sip it. I love it. Uh, besides, what can I? I also. Faith says, always wondered why you say you are a South African makeup artist. Are you South African or are you Zimbabwean? Vongai <laughs> Mavingiri. I am Zimbabwean, guys. But the reason why I identify myself, especially on YouTube, as a South African Zimbabwean beauty blogger is because I am based in South Africa right now this is where I reside and I don't see myself like going back to Zim anytime soon so the audience that watches me or that I would want to watch me is an audience from South Africa because they can relate to me more because that is where I am based also I do want an audience from Zim to watch me because that's who I am I am Zimbabwean so it's it's got nothing to to do with uh, 
changing my identity no i own it i am zimbabwean but it's because in south africa that's where i'm based and most of the products that i use in my videos they are products that are from south africa so yes um i, I hope that answers your you i don't know like if i did a a good job in answering your question but i hope you get what i'm trying to say i'm not i'm not saying that i am south african nah. Where do you see yourself in the next five to ten years? Hmm. Okay, in the next five to ten years, I, I I would like to see myself like with a bigger YouTube channel, with a lot of following. I would love that. Like that's what I dream of every every other day. That's what I pray for. That's what I want. So I I want to see myself as a bigger YouTuber in the next five to ten years. I want to see myself with uh, a cute little baby. Yeah, I want a baby, guys. So in the f next five to ten years, I hope I'll have a child. In the next five to ten years, I want to also have my own makeup line. I am honestly praying for that because I can't be working for other people. Uh, for the longest time, I also need to do something that's going to benefit me directly. So, yeah. I hope you are answered. And the last question that I'm going to tackle right now is, does your accent bother you? No. What do you mean? My accent doesn't bother me at all. That's who I am. That's how I speak. So what should I do about it? That's how I speak, you guys. So my accent doesn't bother me. For the longest time, I've always heard people say to me, oh, you, you sound different. Oh, how do you speak? That's how I speak. That's who I am. It's got, it's got everything to do with the way I was taught English. Whoever taught me how to speak English, that's how I was taught. It does not bother me because that's that's me. I can change it. Even if, even if I wanted to change it, I can change it. I wouldn't want to change it anyway. So the way I speak my English doesn't bother me. Do I get bothered if I'm not speaking English properly? If I'm not using the right terms? No, it does not bother me. It's not my home language. So why would I want to perfect? So does your accent bother you? No, it doesn't. I would be bothered though if my contour wasn't right. <laughs> okay guys, that's that. Uh, those are the, all the questions that I managed to answer from you. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you have been watching me this far and you haven't subscribed to my channel, it's time now you take time to subscribe to my channel. I love you guys and I will see you in my next video. Bye!